Hey guys, I know you guys are waiting for this for so long and here you guys go. SPM Biology Analysis for November 2025. Now, you have seen my last video. I did a SPM 2025 analysis for SPM, but that one is for last batch and this one is going to be the new one, right? Now, remember, before I start, this is just the analysis, nothing to do with the question that will come out in your SPM. This is just for fun only, like literally. So let's have a look. Now, let me explain what is this, right? So I have injected the questions from SPM 2021 until 2024. All the questions here is being listed here. You can see some of the topics here, conservation and restoration of ecosystem. This kind of question never come out in your SPM before. And uh, some of the question like health issue related to your uh, nervous system is also didn't come out in your SPM before. So after that, I put in the Johor, Geta, Glandan, all the trial papers questions into their respective subtopics right here. So what you guys can see here is some of the questions didn't come out in your SPM, zero. Some comes out a lot in your trial. For example, like this one, okay, it comes out six times in your trial exam. So I put an alert here. And uh, some of the questions here came out seven times, but it comes out one time in your SPM. For example, like these questions, meristematic tissue and growth. This kind of question come out in your SPM 2022. But for this year, the trial papers, it came out seven times. All right. So let's simply look at one of the questions here, like SPP question, meristematic. Let's look at question 4A right here. So we can see this is a growth zone of the reticle cell of a seedling. And then uh, the question asks you to identify the zone X and zone Y. This is going to be the meristematic cell of the plants. It falls under Form 5, Chapter 1, meristematic tissue. Yep, if you guys go through the trial exam papers right here, you will see a lot of questions actually come out of this topic, meristematic tissue and also growth. So you guys can slowly look at the analysis here. Maybe you guys can screenshot. You guys can go through it by your own. Like I said, this is for fun only, but if you guys really have no direction to study, you want something fun, I actually have compiled some of the questions here, the alert one, all right, the alert questions into a subtopical worksheet, for example, like this. The subtopic for nucleic acid, the subtopic for health issue related to the nervous system, the subtopic for the menstrual cycle and so on. Yep, that is the things that I've done. So maybe if you guys are interested, maybe we can have a sharing session to talk about how can we answer this kind of question and also the creative way to memorize all these uh, biology terms right here. All right. So, yep. And I will see you guys in the future. All right. Bye.